Hey there, tech enthusiasts and app developers. Today, we're diving into the exciting world of GitHub Spark, a groundbreaking tool that's revolutionizing the way we create full stack applications. Imagine being able to build an entire app just by describing it in plain language. No servers, no complex configurations, just type and watch your idea come to life. Sounds too good to be true? Well, buckle up, because that's exactly what GitHub Spark does. Let's kick things off with a quick demonstration. Picture this, you type in a natural language prompt, and within seconds, you see a fully functional live app materialize before your eyes. It's not magic, it's GitHub Spark, and it's changing the game for developers everywhere. So what exactly is Spark? It's an AI-powered tool that's part of the Copilot Pro Plus Preview, designed to help you create micro apps, or Sparks, faster than ever before. Whether you're working on desktop or mobile, Spark has got you covered. It's built on three key components, a natural language editor, a managed runtime, and a progressive web app PWA dashboard. Together, these elements make app creation a breeze. Now, let's talk about some of Spark's top features that are getting developers excited. First up is the natural language to app conversion. You simply describe your app idea and Spark, powered by Claude Sonic 4, generates both the front-end and back-end code for you. It's like having a team of developers at your fingertips. But that's not all. Spark also offers one-click deployment. No more wrestling with hosting services or authentication systems. GitHub Actions are included, so your app is ready to go live in an instant. And if you're the type who likes to see results immediately, you'll love the live preview feature. It gives you instant feedback on your changes and even offers multiple variants to choose from. Spark doesn't stop at just generating code. It comes with a built-in key value store for data storage, the Mabel UI elements, and it's PWA ready out of the box. Plus, it leverages GitHub models for AI features, so you don't need to worry about API keys or external services. Now, let's peek under the hood and see how Spark works its magic. At its core is the natural language editor. You write in plain text, and Spark interprets your words, generating the necessary code. This editor isn't just a text box, it offers interactive previews, keeps track of your revision history, and can even generate multiple variants of your app. The real heavy lifting is done by Spark's agent-based code generation system. It takes your prompts and context, feeds them to an AI agent, which then writes the code, runs it, and deploys your app. All of this happens on a managed runtime that handles the nitty-gritty details like hosting, data storage, authentication, and UI defaults. But enough theory, let's look at some real-world examples. GitHub has showcased several micro apps built with Spark, including an allowance tracker, a city news app, and even a karaoke scheduler. The best part, these Sparks aren't just for show. You can share them with the community, and others can fork and adapt your creations to suit their needs. Even tech giants are taking notice. Sachin Deller, CEO of Microsoft, recently posted about Spark, calling it a new tool in Copilot that turns your ideas into full-stack apps. That's some high praise. Now, I know you're itching to see Spark in action, so let's build a sample app together. We'll head over to the Spark interface and prompt it to create a word search game. Watch in amazement as Spark generates the UI and game logic in seconds. Want to make it more challenging? No problem. We can refine our app with natural language edits. Let's tell Spark to add diagonal words and see how it iterates on our design. Of course, like any tool, Spark has its best practices and limitations. When using Spark, keep your prompts clear and specific for the best results. Always verify the output by checking the preview. Sometimes the generated code might need a bit of tweaking. It's important to note that Spark is best suited for micro apps. It may occasionally miss your intent or include bugs, so if you're handling sensitive data, make sure to inspect the generated code carefully. So why does Spark matter? Well, it's a game changer for prototyping. You can go from idea to testable app in minutes, not days or weeks. 
This makes it perfect for creating low-cost internal tools, impressive client gamas, or those one-off utilities you've always wanted to build but never had the time for. And the best part, it integrates seamlessly with other GitHub tools like Copilot, code spaces, and repositories, so your Spark is ready to scale when you are. Now, I know you're excited to try Spark for yourself. If you have Copilot Pro Plus, you can start building your own Sparks right away. And don't keep your creations to yourself. Share your Spark with the community and remix others' ideas. The possibilities are endless. Before we wrap up, I want to hear from you. What Spark will you build? A personal finance tracker, a habit-forming app, or maybe something completely out of the box? Drop your ideas in the comments below. I can't wait to see what you come up with. Remember, with GitHub Spark, the only limit is your imagination. So go ahead, start typing and watch your ideas come to life. Happy sparking, everyone!